Hello everyone and welcome to the inaugural Jack Daniels Racing Go-Kart Challenge. There is an enormous air of anticipation and excitement here at the track today because these contestants have come from all over Australia to challenge for the great race. Conditions here today are absolutely perfect. There is plenty of grip in these carts and everyone is looking forward to letting loose on this track. These carts don't exactly have 600 horsepower, so it's a compromise between the shortest possible route you can take and the most momentum you can carry. Act crazy and generally everyone gets out of your way. That's what I found. <laughs> You've got one lap to sort it out. The earlier qualifying sessions were absolutely brutal. We've ended up with Team Curry in pole position. Here's the driver's thoughts. Bit of, bit of bad advice for the end of the straight. All right, so you think Rick really cost you P1? Oh, P1 was out the door because of Rick, yeah. It's not too bad, a bit slippery out there, but it's still sliding around a bit. The driver never blames himself. That's rule number one of racing. Well done. Let's see what Rick Kelly can do. Let's see if he can beat that. Well, Rick Kelly, you love to qualify and you've done it again. Another pole to add to your career here at this race. Well done. Unfortunately, the Chief Steward, Todd Kelly, has relegated you to the rear of the field for having two hairy legs, so... I should have had a five-proof suit. I reckon this is pretty flammable. So, conditions are absolutely perfect. The drivers are ready. The track is set. Green light. We're racing. Tight start and Sheridan Hetherington's got away for Team Hetherington in cart number one. A handy lead. Bit of jostling at the rear of the field. At the moment, they're that busy fighting with each other that our two leaders out in front have got a pretty clean run. Down the main straight, we have a challenge for the lead. Steel Mellon is having a go on the inside as he got it done cleanly. Looks like he has. So as they come in for the pit stop, it is car number 11, Steel Mellon, who pitched the lead from Sheridan Hetherington. Driver change as quick as they can because this will be crucial. Rick's got off to a good start, Tim. Yeah, five laps to go, just need a Try and get Ricky's first win for the year. Ready to go. Rick, well done. He may have lost it in the pit change. He was just a bit slow getting out. Yeah, I'm not sure what the problem was there. We, uh, we got the change done OK, and then he just didn't seem to take off. So they dropped from first, and they are now in fourth. Or will it be fifth? Andrew Kuna's got time to wave to the crowd as he goes down the main straight. This is a hot little race. But the intensity out on the track has been incredible. No major incidents. And all of these drivers are performing magnificently. What a final lap we have seen. Car 13. Payne Curry and his teammate Tony Gardner take the chequered flag. So the celebrations continue for our winners of the Jack Daniels Racing Go-Kart Challenge. On behalf of Jack Daniels Racing, we hope you enjoyed it. We'll see you next time.